I'm Ed Overshield, uh, and I hate cancer. Took my mom, it almost took me down. I'm here to tell you that you know, there's something that can be done about it. Five years ago, I was diagnosed with non-small cell lung cancer, and it was type B, where I had metastasized from a four centimeter nob in my upper right lung to my sternum. My, and that's uh, where I was at when they discovered it, it was stage three. I took my mom, so it was 1988 that she was diagnosed with lung cancer, and in 1989 she died. And it uh, was a hard thing. Then I got it at the same age, and I couldn't believe it. I always felt from day one that if I was going to beat this, and if I'm going to have a chance, I got to go beyond the traditional treatments. When I finished my last radiation and chemotherapy, you ring a, you ring a little bell, and, the, and my oncologist put, took me aside and says, Ed, there's something out that I need you to consider and I want you to try and it was an immunology drug he said so the body could recognize it and at the same time kind of up your ante on your own immune system so it sounded great because I knew about immunology drugs uh, I just felt lucky and I did it and, and at the end of the year he could see everything in there well enough to say with confidence that it had been eradicated you know, great. <laughs> it turned out, uh, what more could you ask for? Immunotherapy has opened the door for people to now survive cancer that could never survive it before. And it's a real game changer. I, I'm a blessed person. I got a great life and uh, I'm very, very healthy right now. As healthy as I've ever been after having cancer. So it can happen.